how much grocery costs you in Ukraine if you are on a budget? How cheap is Ukraine cheap? And what kind of products and what kind of quality can you count on if you want to spend a lesser amount of money in Ukraine? Keep watching to find out. And if you're generally interested in life in Ukraine, as told by an expat who's been here for the last two years, feel free to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell. I already filmed a very popular video about grocery shopping in Les Ilpo, and a lot of you have pointed out, and rightfully so, I think that Les Ilpo is a very luxurious shopping experience, and it's not really representative of shopping in Ukraine. So this time around, I need groceries again, and I'm going to go to a store which is at the other end of the spectrum, which is a cheaper store, worse service. I uh, <laughs> tell you this in advance, don't expect any smiles and politeness and like niceties, because probably you won't find them there, but definitely with a larger variety of cheaper products. And also the store is open 24 seven. And I assume there are other ATV stores, which are also open 24 hours per day, which is very convenient if in the middle of night you're craving some chips or alcohol or whatever you're craving, you know, you can go to the store. And without further ado, let's go to the store. So getting into the store, the first section is with beer. This seems to be a very important part of <laughs> uh, the things that the customers here want. We usually get this sort of beer. So this is half a liter for um, 49 greenness. And if you look at cheaper beers, because obviously there are, um, so one liter and 300 milliliters, 37, 38 greenness. So almost a liter is 20 grivnias. Should we get some beer? Fruits and vegetables, just what we're interested in. So let's go with apples, because this is a staple. So one kg of apples, 20 grivnias. This is the green apples, the sour ones. And then also 18 grivnias for the golden. This is a really good apple, Red Prince. It's for 26 uh, greenness per kg. For the exotic fruits, the fruits that don't grow in Ukraine. So uh, the pomelo is 46 greenness per kg. Grapefruit, 32 greenness per kg. And then lemons, 35 greenness per kg and avocados are super cheap here. It's uh, 13 greenness per 100 grams, but as you can see, they're not very good quality. We took them once or twice from here and I would definitely not recommend them. They are cheap, but it's impossible to eat them. Oh, and bananas, another staple. So bananas are 26, 30 greenness per kg and they look pretty good. We'll take this one. Uh, let's uh, have a look at the veggies. The ginger is 13 greenness per 100 grams. And um, from the veggies that we usually take, these tomatoes are 43 greenness per kg. They look a little bit green, but I suppose in um, the spring, in early spring, everything is kind of expensive. So I think this is the cheapest you can get. Both of these cucumbers are from the greenhouse. These are 58 grivnias and the other ones are 60, um, 63. This look better and they feel like crunchy fresh cucumbers. One kg would be 104 grivnias. This is, this is pretty good. So the cheapest potatoes that we can find here, um, no, I, th I think it's this one. So, 10 grivnias for, a, uh, for one kg of uh, potatoes. And if you want washed potatoes, you have to be ready to pay 19 grivnias per kg. So carrots are seven grivnias, yeah. There are the washed, the dirty ones. We love juices here. So one of our like favorite juice companies is Adeski Konservny Zavod Dzitachevo Kharchevanya. Um, this was initially um, a company that was producing for children. Um, so we usually take the tomato juice and some sort of like fruit juice. Tomato juice is 21 grivnias per, uh, per liter. And the other juices 
are also around 20. Okay, guys, let's look at bread. So we have a very small aisle with, with bread. Um, so let's see. I think this would be a typical bread. It's not cut. And one piece is 990 or 1090, so around 10 or 11 greenness. If we are talking about bread that has been pre-cut, like this one, this one is 1350, so a little bit more expensive. Uh, and if you want some toaster bread, then for this piece, you can pay around 14 hryvnias. We usually take Barilla, which is a very good uh, Italian brand. So for half kg, uh, you pay 31 hryvnias. Uh, but there are more accessible pastas, like for example, I think same half kg. It's for only 11 hryvnias. This is um, probably a Ukrainian brand. Now, if you talk about milk and dairy products, this is Ukrainian, um, almost a liter, I think. Well, 900 grams is 38.30, but it's really delicious. Um, and it's with fresh fruits, um, for example, strawberries in this one. Our favorite, the milk. We usually take this two liter, um, two liter pack, and it's 53.40 for two liters, which makes it like 20, 27 for one liter. This one is 24 per liter, so very, very comparable. This should be the cheapest, right? 18 grivnias 50 is probably this milk. Eggs here are a little bit cheaper than the ones in Sipo. Usually a pack of 10 eggs is around 34 hryvnias. But if you take the ones from below, uh, each egg is only 3 hryvnias. So 10 eggs would be 30 hryvnias, 50. If you are on a budget, uh, you're going to eat some pilmeni, some vareniki. <laughs> this is very budget-friendly food. Among the things that we like, there are some very good pilmeni from Levada, this ones. And they should cost you 63 hryvnias for a package, and this is one kg. Yeah, almost one kg. I can see that the cheaper pilmeni for one kg, like less than one kg, are around 50 hryvnias, but we will settle with the ones that we like. We can try this ones. This is only beef. What do you say? Onward we go <laughs> to salami land. For example, this stick of salami is 38 grivnias for 100 grams. And I think here are around 400 grams. So the cheapest is around 27 per 100 grams. And the most expensive is, I think this one, 84. A whole chicken is uh, 6 uh, grivnias 38 for 100 grams. Oh, I think there are 2 kgs here. This is a whole chicken. And also they have conveniently packaged uh, chicken breast. Two companies. Oh, this is uh, 14 grivnias, this is 11 grivnias. This would be cheaper. So chicken breast, conveniently packaged, 11 grivnias per 100 grams. Oh, and by the way, they don't have any fresh fish. We have here the, all the marinated fish, all the salted fish. And here, it's all frozen. So the varieties that they have are um, Barada, Hex Cumbria. Uh, I will translate them on the screen. And they also have some shrimps and some salmon fillets, frozen vegetables, um, I see like 17, 20 grivnias. This is usually 400 grams. The last thing that I want to show you really is maybe the alcohol or the shower gels. 
the alcohol. That's more interesting. Okay, so let's look for something that we can compare, I guess. Not sure this is wine. Oh, what about this one? So bubbly wine, Martini Asti, a bottle is 354 grivnias. Vodka is very popular in Eastern Europe, Ukraine, including Ukraine. So one bottle of Hortica, the vodka here is 178 grivnias. Oop. I think this is a Ukrainian brand, right? And here we have some cognac, some brandies. Um, do I see something? Oh, th uh, this is a Ukrainian company, Chabot. Um, so one bottle, half a liter is 170 grivnias. Snacks, chips. Thank you so much for watching guys if you're interested in some more content i think you would really enjoy those videos and i'm really curious whether the products and the prices that i presented to you today are cheap in your country or do you have even cheaper products and cheaper ways of getting you know a decent quality of groceries wherever you're living leave down in the comments different prices for different products let's share let's see which country is the cheapest in terms of prices thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.